What's going on guys? In this video, let's make something a bit special. Five foods that will get you jacked. Alright, let's jump straight into it. Whether you're natural or not, I know my channel is a lot of time for natural lifters, but natural or not, guys, you can benefit from this information. Number one, eggs. And I'm not talking eggs, whole eggs, not only egg whites. A lot of people go only for egg whites. And guys, this is the worst thing you can do for your body. You know why? Because the protein in the egg whites basically will digest better when it's combined with the whole eggs, the fats from the whole eggs. And not only that, in the fats, there's a lot of vitamins and minerals that are crucial for you to help you get jacked, to help you get strong. Vitamin K, vitamin D, biotin, choline. Guys, don't fear away from the fats, from the egg yolk or feed cholesterol because cholesterol is going to be helping you produce testosterone, which will help you get jacked, all right? So whole eggs. I've, I've just done a podcast, so if you see me that I'm not able to talk well, that's pretty much why. So whole eggs, all right? Number two, it's not here, but it's red meat, all right? A lot of people fear red meat, and red meat is so much more powerful than chicken or white fish. Guys, it's not just about the macros, the protein, but also about the vitamins and minerals that red meat has, all right? The iron, zinc, uh, B12, those minerals are super hard to get. All right, so guys, don't throw away the red meat. Don't think that red meat is going to cause a lot of issues because it has been associated with a bad reputation. I'm a big fan of red meat. What I would say is uh, prioritize the lean cut. So I would go for extra lean ground beef, filet mignon, steaks that are low in fat. All right, red meat. I'm a big fan of red meat. I would, be, I would think it's the only superfood, if superfood exists. Number three, Greek yogurt. I'm a big fan of Greek yogurt, guys, not only because it has calcium, probiotics, but also because it's very low in calories and high in protein. It's a great thing to add on your diet if you're dieting down. Now I'm dieting down. You know what I look forward to? Every evening when I'm watching Soprano on my TV, I would put a big bowl of Greek yogurt and some berries, one pack of stevia, half a scoop of protein powder. My God, it tastes just better than the dessert. All right, Greek yogurt, full of vitamins and minerals, high in protein, low in calories, zero or two percent fat. Just don't get the ones that have a lot of added sugar. Get the plain one and yourself put some fruits in there. Moving on, this is a very special one that a lot of people will miss. It's pickles. Pickles. Why pickles? Well, basically it's salt, all right? If I would have to choose something, it would be salt. But I love pickles because your body can absorb the salt better when it's associated with the food, all right? If you can just drink salted water, a lot of time you will just evacuate it. But as opposed to eating your salt, like pickles, kimchi, whatever, salty stuff, your muscles will absorb salt a lot better. Why am I a big fan of salt? Why I think salt is also a superfood and will help you get jacked? Because salt means more hydration in your muscles. Your body will, your muscles will retain more water. More water in your muscles, that's the best thing ever. Why? Better performance, better endurance, less risk of injury, better hydration. Don't fear salt, guys. That's cramping, trust me. So many videos, so many studies. Uh, just people having more salt in their diet, performance went through the roof, results and a better hydration. Do not fear salt. A lot of people fear salt. They do a lot of sauna, a lot of running. They're into fitness. They think that sodium will all of a sudden make their face puffy. That's not true, guys. Don't fear salt. Don't limit it. It's essential. And if you're not regenerating it from the sweat you're losing, you're not regenerating that, uh, you're missing out and you're causing yourself a lot of issues. Lastly, I don't have it here too. It would be salmon. All right, I'm a big fan of salmon. Now I'm in contest prep, eight weeks out. I'm not eating a lot of salmon because it's a fatty fish, high in calories. I'm taking my omega-3 pills, but guys, if you're not trying to lean down as much as possible, and like me, get as lean as humanly possible, uh, you still want to include salmon in your diet. It is a superfood, the omega-3, the omega-6 in there, the omega-3 fatty acids. It's just a great superfood, all right? That's pretty much it. Five foods, if I would add one, it would be apple or any kind of fruit, all right? And pretty much with those foods. Oh, let's talk about another one, potatoes. I love potatoes. This is my favorite source of carb, potatoes. Why? Not a, so, if you guys didn't know, potato uh, contain a complete uh, protein. They have all the essential amino acids in potato. So that's why a lot of Irish in the Irish... Uh, when they had no more uh, food or whatever, they were only eating potatoes and they were surviving and thriving pretty much because it, it is, I don't know if they were thriving, but they were surviving because it's a full protein and also gives your body good carbs. Potato has also a lot of potassium, twice the amount of a banana, 
I'm pretty sure it's very high in potassium, very high in vitamins and minerals, a good source of carbs, glycemic index is pretty good, not that I believe in all the glycemic index BS, but uh, it's a full uh, protein, which is pretty good with that, and high amount of potassium. That's pretty much it, guys. Leave a like, leave a comment, leave a follow. I'll see you guys soon. Ciao.